Jack, technology's role in healthcare's innovation. Stay tuned to learn more how technology is really supporting healthcare innovation and more importantly, patient-centered care. Chief Marketing Officer for Wesley Clover International, and welcome to Tech Tuesday. Tonight is all about a landscape of innovation in healthcare technology. Tonight, we're going to hear from four amazing panelists, all incredible representatives of different aspects of healthcare here in Ottawa. They're doing amazing things with respect to technology and innovation. When we started developing our nursing program, we were looking at traditional lab space on campus. Because we're located at CU at Canada at 350 Leggett, I had the opportunity to walk around, and in doing that, I just intersected with a number of tech uh, startups. And so when they found out I was a nurse, they were like, hey, we have this product. Can you just, just for a minute, just tell us if it works or not? Because you know we're very on the tech side, but we don't know how patient care works. And so I had the opportunity to look at a product uh, with Bruce, who's on the panel with me tonight, where we look at insoles and we look at the reality of patient care and it was just such an organic opportunity to work closer together so we very purposely put our nursing simulation labs in the middle of the tech park so that again we're physically bridging the gap between the siloed approaches between clinical and technical so what we're looking at now is we have a competency-based model for medical education to maintain excellent standardization but it's lacking any approach to AI or the use of technology so we've embedded competencies specifically addressing AI ethical use of AI how we bring in patients to AI AI, and that model is now being reviewed internationally and globally. So the University of Ottawa is making its largest investment uh, ever in new facilities uh, with the um, development of the Advanced Medical Research Center, a 350,000 square foot, $300 million facility that is currently under construction on Smythe Road. And this hub will, will act as a hub for the entire ecosystem in terms of supporting companies and supporting technology development in the life sciences field, both from a biological vaccine biotherapeutic standpoint all the way through digital health and AI. Innovation Hub will provide an opportunity for companies under one roof to access all they need to support the technology translation and their movement from that technology from the bench to the bedside. This Techopia Live was brought to you by our amazing sponsors. Founded in 2001 and based in Canada North, FIDUS helps its customers innovate, design, and deliver. FIDUS transforms ideas into the product that you've imagined. The award-winning team at FIDUS are specialists in FPGA design, embedded software, hardware, ASIC RTL design and verification, and signal integrity. FIDUS customers appreciate the precision-driven, first-time right approach with a 99% success rate and a 95% return rate. FIDUS collaborates with many of the world's market leaders, including AMD, Cisco, Google, and Tesla. FIDUS continues to set the standard for innovation and technical excellence. FIDUS was recently awarded the prestigious AMD Partner of the Year, standing out among 39 AMD Premier Partners for its unmatched expertise. FIDUS was also recognized as the Tech Company of the Year at the Best Ottawa Business Awards, celebrating its industry leadership, business achievements, and community impact. Book a design consult today by visiting FIDUS.com. Ross 
Hospital, our innovation program is based off of an open innovation model. So we actually innovate from within the hospital, um, working with our own physicians, researchers, scientists, staff on inventions or ideas that they have and helping them bring that to life. But we also innovate from outside where we partner with startup companies, global health and life sciences companies to really help uh, understand and find value in the system with new innovations that are coming out uh, into the market. So we're really looking at improving patient outcomes by decreasing costs and creating value in the health system. Celestra Health is a software company that has developed a digital biomarker for measuring human gait for patients that have neurological diseases such as multiple sclerosis and Parkinson's disease. My big takeaway would be that Ottawa and Canada in general is an amazing place to start up a healthcare company. There's support from all levels of government, including municipal through Invest Ottawa, as well as provincial and federal levels. Our big vision is really care of our people. Uh, how can we contribute to the Ottawa community? And we decided to start right here, um, and then we will expand to across Ontario and uh, Canada, and hopefully one day in the U.S. as well. But we're really dedicated to serve the community here in Ottawa first. And thanks to our sponsors. EY, building a better working world. Fidus Systems, specialists in electronic product development. Hurley Robertson, Hill & McDougall, Ottawa's longtime leader in business and technology law. The University of Ottawa Faculty of Engineering, developing the next generation of tech talent. Thank you for watching uh, our Tech Tuesday Techopia Live fascinating panel of experts who brought to us the importance of innovation in healthcare and all of the things that go along with that that we are all striving for in Ottawa in terms of healthcare and better outcomes.